It's been a while. One, two, maybe a month. Wow. I know. I missed you as well. How are you? Welcome back to the vlog, My Life on Two Wheels. What do we have in store for you this week? Riding in the heat, Asioma power pedal issues, launched a ticket. Riding with someone new, riding with someone who's not Linda, and riding with Linda. So much to unpack. Let's do it. Apologize ahead of time if you are offended by male cleavage because um, <laughs> there may be some of this action happening today. So if this does offend you, turn off now. If it doesn't, stick around. Hello, my life on two wheels. It has been a little while. It has been a few weeks. Let's see if I can still remember how to do this vlog thing. Exceedingly hot in the nation's capital. It is 8.45 on a Saturday morning and uh, we're out early, early-ish to try and beat the heat. It's hot. It's a hot one. Uh, yeah. Just if there was just a little breeze. Mm. A little breeze would be nice. So we're up in the Gatineau Park. We're gonna go for a little ride up here. I was up here yesterday. I'm gonna talk about that in a second. And uh, we're gonna see how far we get mm. before uh, he gets the better of us. Riding in the heat, uh, songs, gloves. I'm not a big fan of riding with gloves. I get the whole safety aspect uh, of going down, putting your hands down. Uh, I get the padding. It helps alleviate some of the stress points when you're in the, uh, the hoods or the drops or the tops. I get all that, but when it's, uh, it's planned to be 40 degrees in the nation's capital today, when it gets that warm, I just can't do the gloves. I need the, uh, the cool breeze, the cool breeze, whatever that is today, uh, gliding across the top of my hands when I'm riding. So let's, uh, let's go generate some cool breeze. Let's go generate. Cool breeze, by the way, was my uh, nickname in high school. <laughs> All the kids called me cool breeze. Yeah. <laughs> okay, two of the bigger climbs done. A couple more to go. Uh, big shout out to Kevin. Kevin is a, uh, a loyal viewer of my life on two wheels. He reached out to me. He is a denizen of Ottawa. He reached out to me. He said, hey, let's go for a ride sometime. So I put him off, I put him off, I put him off due to scheduling conflicts. Um, have a good ride. And uh, we finally managed to make it happen. We uh, finally managed to make magic happen up here yesterday. Uh, super strong rider. Uh, hey Kevin, if you're watching, thanks very much. I haven't ridden with anyone outside of Linda in a while, so I was a little concerned that I'd be very slow, slowing him down. He's a stronger rider than I am, way fitter than I am, but uh, I think I held my own. And uh, if I slowed you down, Kevin, I apologize profusely, but uh, let's do it again sometime soon. Ah, reaching the uh, fitness pinnacle. It takes a long time. I don't know how much training you do over the winter, but obviously, you know, it's more sustaining for me than actually increasing my fitness. I just, uh, I bang out the mileage on Zwift. So it takes a little while to get up to what I think is optimum summer fitness, but I'm pretty close to it. Much to Linda's chagrin. I'm, uh, I'm feeling pretty good these days. Diet's good, nutrition's good. Legs are feeling pretty good. I say that now. <laughs> That's gonna come back to bite me. All right, let's go pick up Linda. She's um, uh, back there somewhere. Let's go find her. Wonder how much shit I wrote down, you never broke down. My back used to be up against walls, it's on the ropes now. Fighting for that feeling we had in your Laredo. Back when you saw the thorns on my crown, more like a halo. My conscience punished me for the past while I was out there trying to ball. Bet you seen through the mask, hope I ain't being brash. If I say you could have split it with me, girl, you would see riches with me if you stuck around through the rags. My motivation these days is different. I mostly be to my. Any Asioma owners out there watching the vlog? If there is. Do you have any dropout issues? Last few weeks I've noticed that my power has uh, just been, uh, has not been there on my head unit. It looks like the, uh, the transmitter in the Asioma 
or the receiver in the Garmin head unit. And they're not happy. There's no handshaking going on. So let me know if you've seen any dropout issues with the single-sided Asiomas. What's a good bike ride without some technical issues? Oh, yeah. <laughs> Are you kidding me? Yeah, yeah. Hello! Yeah. Good to see you! <laughs> yeah. Very cool. So I just told them all that I've attained my peak summer fitness and uh, it's all uphill from here. Have you reached your peak summer fitness? Wow, that's not a question that was floating around in my brain. Uh, I hope not. I hope not. How many Ks did you do this week? 160. I'm very happy with myself. 150 is my goal. 160, just over 160 was, my, uh, was what I did this week. It helped having an extra day off work. Yeah, I think we all wish we could ride more. But uh, yeah, 160K. Congratulations. Well, thank you. You're very welcome. How many did you do this week? I don't know, but I think it was more than that. Probably. Yes. <laughs> All right, guys, that's a wrap. We will regroup next week. A bit of a, um, a precursor, I guess. The chap you just saw there who was uh, very excitable, uh, I'm supposed to ride with him on Friday. Also coming up on Friday, someone's birthday. Who could it be? <laughs> More on that next week. Take care.